Hey guys, Sarah here. Have you ever settled? Like even in the most simple way, have you ever settled? Because I vowed when we moved here that I would not settle, that I would not buy something and not love it for this house. And I was tempted to settle because I didn't want to go through the headache of exchanging or returning and bagging and like you know when you unfold curtains to hang them it's not exactly the most um, easy thing to do to put them back in their packaging so I just wanted to avoid the whole thing I didn't want to go yeah all the time right next to me pretty cute though right he has brought so much life back to that old man. Anywho, as I was saying, don't settle, you guys. Just don't do it because it's not worth it. In the long run, you have to love what what you're you have to love everything about your home, about you know, if you're gonna spend money, if you're gonna invest money that you've worked hard for, that your husband's worked hard for, then you need to love what you buy. Don't settle for anything. I did it for too long and I vowed I wouldn't do it now. So I did bag up, repackage four panels because the very room I'm standing in, in would look like a dungeon. Like, thank goodness I opened them back up because they were just way darker than I thought they were gonna be. And so I did the hard thing. I still have the whole processing, going to the store and all that. I know it's such a headache. I mean, first world problems for sure. I feel blessed in every way. It's just one of those things, those hoops that I never wanted to jump through, but I've decided not to settle and I suggest the same for you. So if you needed to hear this, I'm glad. Don't settle. If there's someone that you know that needed to hear this, tag them, share it, whatever you gotta do and subscribe too. Take care.